Good, whatever it is, I'm Mantos. Welcome back to Space Engineers. Woo, my voice. Um, so there are several ships around here. Um, instinct, atmospheric frigate. Uh, I've been looking around and I found something. There is a wreck that's not mine for once. And so what I'm thinking I'm going to do is we're going to take this little ship, a little still unnamed nanite ship, and we're going to go explore that wreck, but we got to do it very carefully because it still has active turrets. So yeah, we're going to just head over there and ignore all this other stuff. I think we'll be okay. And power-wise, 21 hours in flight. That's not loaded, so it will be significantly less once we're full. I've also done some modifications to this. We've got a top-middle reactor, and we've got a battery in between the cockpit and the two nanite systems. And so I'm thinking this ship will be perfect to let us tear that apart. I'm hoping. Because of all the nanite systems. And the nanite system don't have they don't have much range, which is our balance, so I don't think it will be too cheaty to use them. We're going to have to stay pretty far away from this further, much, much further than that. There it is, and it's shooting at us. Dive, 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 dive. What is... Why does the game keep cutting out? Down. Down, we're being hit. Get closer. I think there's a turret blind spot. And it looks like I might be in it. Or I'm just too far away now. So we're gonna go closer. And lower. And I'm thinking if I can sneak this up. I need to get my camera established. Whoops. Down. Oh. Oh. Jeez, I jumped. Down down. Okay, so I'm thinking I can sneak this up and we can use this terrain here to get rather close to it. Unknown signal, don't care, I have much much better stuff. Let's get the camera established. Camera 2 and camera 3. I do not know where those are. I only see one camera on this. What is up with all these freeze-ups too? So our thrusters on the back are kind of underpowered, and so that's why this climb is going to take a little while. If we go up a little bit though, we can make it easier, as long as we don't get spotted by the turrets. Okay, let's let's arm the cameras. You So I am thinking oh We've got a turret over there. I'm thinking we might be able to sneak up directly behind this thing. And slowly cut it away. But while I'm doing this, funny story about last time I recorded. Um, I complained about being down oh, to only one monitor. And then, like, minutes later, one of my friends texted me, 
and said he was trying to get rid of a monitor. So I'm now back at two monitors. Oh dear. Not, no. So I'm back to two monitors again. What is... No, 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 no. I'm missing thrusters. Oh, no, I'm not. I have side-to-side -side thrusters. They're just badly damaged. We're going to set down here, I'm thinking. Ah, I'll never survive this run on foot. Our cockpit seems relatively intact. We're going to we're going to keep going in this ship and that's a huge huge risk. I wish I knew how far away that was. Okay, let's set up the build and repair system. So we lost our left thruster and two up thrusters. Build new, use ignore color, grind enemy blocks, blind. Yes. As soon as we get close enough, I want you to start tearing that thing apart. And the close enough is 25 meters, if I recall right. I think we're okay for a little bit. Come on. If I can just set this down on- Oh, 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 oh! Shoot, 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 shoot! Goodbye. Okay! What is with all these random freeze-ups? Okay, hold on a second. I'm- I'm betting I know. We're gonna remove. And next. I'm thinking it has to do with the same mod that actually is giving us the ship we're attacking. We're just going to remove the flying ones. Okay. Okay. Now, we are... kind of sort of really vulnerable. Like, one shot could kill us. So, slow and careful. Oop! Oh. Not this way. Ooh! One health. Okay. Let me remove that Sky Factory real quick. Gotta remember the controls to do this first. Next. Next. Remove. And I probably just want to disable this mod. Honestly. 13 health. I don't really want to sit on the side of this cliff forever. But I also don't really want to die. That just sounds like a bad idea. What's right here? A gyroscope. It's got bits down here. Maybe I can repurpose these into something to, tell, to tear it apart. I'm not s- Ooh! Huh. That didn't go quite as planned. We're gonna respawn here. And... I'm thinking... Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I don't like using the Space Master, but at the same time, it's kind of tedious to fly all the way over there. So let's let's take a look at this and see what we're up against, because I haven't scouted this out. Okay. Oh, so we've got a tiny turret down there. Several on the roof. 
So we're all out there. This is looking very beyond our ability to take. What I'm thinking we might be able to do... Oh, no. Never mind. That turret right there means that that's not a possibility. I was thinking what we could do is just go up way above this. Like around, I don't know, a kilometer? And then just jump it. And then last second turn on our jetpack. And land on the roof. But these turrets... Try to slow down my speed. Right here. Cover this roof. And I think it's covered from every single angle. Yeah. It looks really cool though. I like it. This is right side up and we're in a chair. I've never toured one of these before. Holy turrets. Yeah, we're gonna need a new plan. This thing is covered. And even more turrets in case... You know, just in case you need them. It's like an observation deck. Yeah, observation. Okay. It's got a jump drive though. Ooh. I want one. I so want one. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna build a ship to do this. And Okay. So our main goal is the turrets. In order to avoid the turrets, they have to be shooting at something else. If we can land on the surface of that, whoops, oh, wrong way, I'm flipped upside down because the ship is upside down, large reactor. If we can land on the surface of this, right here, we're home free. And then we can get inside and have two turrets pointing right at us. But maybe we could take down its power systems. We've got the one large reactor. And presumably we have another power supply, whether it's batteries or another large reactor, I don't know. Computing. This thing has so many. Okay, so I've I think I've got a plan. We're gonna build a Halo craft, and by Halo I don't mean the combat evolved. I mean high altitude, low open parachuting. And so what it's gonna do is we're gonna fly about a kilometer and a half directly over the wreck. At that height, we are going to drop powered decoys with parachute blocks, and that's going to be pricey. Among the decoys is going to be me, and I'm going to land on top with, let me see, make sure I have that mod installed. Oh, it was right there. The hacking computer. And we're going to take over that ship. Yeah, I think that's my my best plan I can think of. Cause that's a lot, a lot of scrap for us. That will finish this whole thing and leave tons left over. Although if I can f take an atmospheric frigate, do I even want this thing? I don't know. So let's fly back to the home base. And get started on it. Okay, you can unlock. I'm gonna want you nearby because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need you. Okay. Can 
I don't think I need this either. Okay, good, it is configured. So... I don't need these. I'm gonna need a landing gear. I'm gonna need many landing gear. Ooh. Let's... Yeah, I like a dark blue color. Oh, and I'm gonna need steel plates to start this out. Whoops. Trying to check my recording time. And I think that's enough to get us started. And then we're gonna need armor blocks. Very bare bones ship, I'm thinking. Five, five gap, one, two, three, four, five. I believe that's one more. Now, how many decoy blocks we're gonna need to drop? 800 meters through heavy turret fighter? Well, fire, not fighter. Fighter. I don't know. And so I'd rather over-engineer this part than under-engineer it. And then we're gonna need these. This is nothing pretty, but it's gonna get the job done. I think. I hope. And we're gonna need atmospheric thrusters times a lot. Now the plan is that this thing's going to be really heavy because of all the decoy blocks it's carrying. Oh, I'm going to want to get rid of these front ones too. And we'll do from there. I want to do equidistant back. And then for power, I'm thinking we're going to go battery powered. But we're definitely going to need more than a single battery. 
I want this to be able to hover until we take over the ship, which I'm guessing will take us a few hours. At least hover until we can take over enough of the ship. So we'll probably plan on building multiple hacking blocks. Means we'll need this stuff on us. Two batteries won't give us a whole ton of flight time. So, oh, we're going to need gyroscopes too. And it's going to need a lot of them. Because it's carrying stuff. Can't decide which way is the same way I have the other one facing. Gonna go with that. And so I think that's gonna be the basic for this ship. Oh, we're gonna want an antenna for sure. And the antenna. And I just put on the back. Okay. Eight drops, 800 meters. I'm going to be falling at max speed hopefully by the time we hit that. We won't need very long. Maybe I need to be able to drop craft for me too. Let's see. We're going to use two to build our decoy. So each decoy ship is going to need a decoy, a parachute, and maybe a parachute's a bit over engineering, and a power source. So we're going to go with a reactor with a tiny, tiny, tiny amount of power in it. Oh, that projector setup I just got rid of might have been perfect for this. Projector. And I have, I honestly don't know which way is top and which way is bottom on these. If I built one of these on each arm, and built a nanite system onto this, I could replenish this thing in the air too. So that's something to think about, but I just looked at the time, we're way over. I'm gonna figure this out, but I'm on Talos, I will catch you later.